go to fathomevents.com. Hi, I'm Robert Osborne. The next film we have to help you get in the festive mood features one of the most famous characters of the holiday season, good old Ebenezer Scrooge from Charles Dickens' A Christmas Carol. It's a beloved tale that's been told in numerous film versions over the years, but few in the way the next one is. It's Ebenezer Scrooge set to music. The title of the movie is Scrooge from 1970 with songs and screenplay by the formidable Leslie Burkus and in the role of Ebenezer Scrooge, the great Albert Finney. Now, when this movie was in the planning stage, Finney was the first choice for the part, even though he'd never done a musical before. But Finney immediately turned it down, doing so without even reading the script. Well, the producers, disappointed, then made an offer to Richard Harris, who'd recently done a musical, Camelot. And he said, yeah, I'll do it. So that was good news, but only for about five minutes, because Harris soon pulled out, because of a scheduling conflict with another film. Scrooge was then offered to Rex Harrison, the one who had started the whole trend of actors without great singing chops, doing musicals by kind of talk singing their songs. Well, Rex did accept the part, but soon after a call came from Albert Finney. He finally read the script, loved it, and wanted to know if the part was still available. Well, the producers were hesitant to take the role away from an actor as celebrated as Rex Harrison, but they really did want Albert Finney. While everybody was deciding what to do, fate stepped in. It said a call came from Rex Harrison, apologizing but asking to be let out of his promise to play Scrooge. Seems he was taking much more time than he'd allotted to learn the lines of a stage play he was committed to do later in the year, and he wanted out of the promise to play Scrooge. So miraculously, everybody involved finally got what they wanted or didn't want after all. Here with the cast, it also includes Sir Alec Guinness, Jamie Meredith Evans, and Kenneth Moore, with direction by Ronald Neen. From 1970, the musicalized Scrooge. <laughs> 